The runway at Sioux City's 185th Air Refueling Wing needs to be extended. And if it's not extended to 10,000 feet, U.S. Senator Joni Ernst of Iowa worries that may cost the base its refueling mission and its tanker squadron. The issue was raised during a Senate Armed Services Committee hearing today into the nomination of General David Alvin to the post of Chief of Staff of the Air Force. That's the principal military advisor to the Secretary of the Air Force. Ernst says when the 185th converted from F-16 fighters to KC-135 tankers in 2003, the Air Force said it would upgrade the airfield. Ernst says the Air Force has failed to follow through on that commitment, and the Republican pressed General Alvin to honor that commitment during today's hearing in Washington. Do I have your commitment that you will work with the National Guard to conduct a proper assessment uh, the run, for the runway upgrade for the airfield at the Iowa National Guard facility in Sioux City, Iowa? Senator, you absolutely do, and I will tell you that uh, the 185th, is a fantastic organization that you know they celebrated i think 70 75th yes. year in 2021 so this is one we, we're nothing if not a total force i do commit to ensuring that that uh, assessment that evaluation is done and in conjunction with the air national guard to ensure that we have understanding of, of cost schedule and performance for that particular initiative now, here's why the runway extension is so necessary. Right now, those KC-135 tankers can't take off over a certain weight to make sure they're not damaging the runway further. So the tankers take off when they're not fully fueled.